Hi guys, it's Lynn here. Hope everyone is keeping really well and safe. Now today guys, just a very short video and I wanted to show you this because it's sort of the first, sort of the first time flowering for us and it's also that little bit more of an unusual type of succulent. Now this is my Euphorbia Ritchie Monodinium and uh, very sort of unusual type of uh, succulent here has a few little pups growing around the base there as you can see and it is in flower today there is three peach colored tiny little flowers going all around the top there very cute just turn around so you can see them um, sort of lovely sort of green in the middle of them and a lovely sort of peachy peach colored little petals very very tiny and as I say this is the first time flowering for us it did produce a little flower I think sort of in the winter time but it was it didn't last very long and uh, now there's the three so it's the first time properly flowering so very happy to see very unusual the plant itself is is very wacky too very nice sort of reminds me of the um Matilio cactus, booby cactus type of appearance with all its sort of nodules and a sort of very strange appearance to it. But it is it is completely a euphorbia succulent. So um, and it has has the little leaves going all around it as well. Very unusual there. I just wanted to share the rather unusual wackiness with you all to show you it from the top. Absolutely gorgeous. And this particular type of uh, euphorbia, over time, it obviously grows sort of columnar. And then as it gets bigger, it does lean over to the side. And I've seen some very large specimens, some beautiful specimens of this, um, actually in sort of little hanging baskets and things like this. And um, our wonderful friend Peter, who lives in um, Australia, hi Peter, has one of these also because he has a, a big one of these. And um, it, he had it in a big a big sort of bowl basket. It looked absolutely amazing. I said this one is still quite a young one that we've had probably about four or five years now and uh, growing very well. So hopefully one day we'll be, have, be able to have this also in a bit of a hanging basket. I just want to share the little flowers with you all. And if you want to know, if you want to see a complete tour of uh, both me and my fiance Hans's um, Euphorbia collection that we have here in our kitchen, we have these all in our kitchen window sill, which is a south facing window, gets lots of sun. Then please do check out a video I have made on um, a complete collection tour of all of our euphorbias in our kitchen. <laughs> Links up above. And if you want to know a little bit more on how to grow cacti and succulents, then please do check out my website, desertplantsofavalon.com. And guys, thank you so much for watching. I want to send you loads of love heaps of happiness and tons and tons of wacky cactus and succulent power from across the Emerald Isle. And until my next video, bye.